So, free Addy Titus from uh, Texas. Addy Titus? Cleveland, welcome to our third episode of Cleveland, Cleveland Now. Now. By March 14th, students and staff members at PPS will no longer be required to wear masks and now it will be an optional thing. A new subvariant of Omicron was discovered in Denmark early this year, but it's still in early research. From what we know, it's several times more infectious than Omicron, but doesn't seem to be starting this new wave of cases. Russia's large-scale invasion of the Ukraine has brought Ukrainian civilians such as farmers to the front line. Five of Cleveland's speech and debate students have reached the Academic All-American Award, meaning they are part of the top 1% of the National Speech and Debate Association. The award recipients this year are Simone Geit, Ellie Howard, Flannery Gonzalez, Felix Cohen, and Stella Greenvoss. <music> Drippiness. It's a factor. It's something that we admire about people all the time. So my question for you is, on a scale of 1 through 10, how would you rate your outfit on the drippy scale? On the drippy scale? Yeah. 25. <laughs> on the drippy scale, how would you rate your outfit from 1 to 10? Probably like a 3. I kind of wear the same thing every day. <laughs> No. <laughs> on a scale of 1 to 10, how would you rate your outfit on the drippy scale? 1. <laughs> Thank you. 10, how drippy is your fit today? That's a tough one. Uh I think I make this outfit look good, so I'm gonna say a seven. A seven. Okay, last time you rated yourself a four. Yeah. What 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 changed? My confidence grew since then. I guess seven. I guess. Why a seven? I like the sublime coat, and I like this thing. I feel like, I got it. I feel like seven's pretty low. Seven's low. It. My fit. Yes. Yes. Um, I think I'm currently on a solid seven. Negative three, stop lying to yourself. <laughs> it actually is a pretty good outfit. I like the 